This year, we celebrate an incredible milestone. One million people have undergone a bone marrow, stem cell, or cord blood transplant. I'd like you to meet some of them. Aiden enjoys sledding with his younger brother after his transplant for Wiscott Aldrich syndrome in 2010. Clarita is a much loved teacher who underwent two transplants in 2008 and 2009 after being diagnosed with multiple myeloma. Little Lexus learned to ski after her transplant in 2002 for a rare disease called Crabbe disease. Milton had three transplants, one in 2004, another in 2006, and a third in 2007. Spending time with his family and his granddaughter bring him the greatest joy. Kayla loves snow and lots of it, and she now embraces life and all types of winter activities since her transplant for acute myelogenous leukemia in 2004. When Alan was transplanted for myelodysplasia in 2011, he wondered if he would ever again be able to do what he enjoys most, hiking in the mountains. Today, he's back on the trails, enjoying nature and the peace that it brings to him. Sibling rivalry plays no part in Nico's life following his transplant in 2008 for severe aplastic anemia. His sister Jenna was his donor, and the two now share an incredible bond. Tori has traveled the world and is a man of many passions and many talents. His transplant for lymphoma in 2008 brought him an even greater appreciation for life and the wonderful people around him. At BMT InfoNet, it's been our joy to work with hundreds of patients like these throughout the year, bringing them vital information, emotional support, and one-on-one -on -one counseling. Please join us in providing help and hope to families in 2014 by making a year-end contribution to BMT InfoNet. If you or someone you know has been through transplant, you know firsthand how difficult the transplant journey can be. Your donation will make a huge difference in someone's life.